Welcome to Imagination. Hello there, and welcome to another edition of Imagination. I bet you like. You're gonna love it. On today's Imagination, we bring you a special feature on the big hit gambling manga, the Kaiji series. With ultimate psychological tactics fought over big money. A heated drama about men who engage in battles for all or nothing. Serialized from 1996 up to this day, the franchise has expanded into anime and live films. Kaiji has a lot of original gambling games too. What lies behind this new style different from previous gambling manga? We've talked with the creator of the original work, Nobuyuki Fukumoto. Oh, Hi, nice to meet you. In creator's interview, we welcome anime director Suno Katabuchi. The true character of the creator who made My My Miracle like. Now, prick up your ears because Dominic's still up there somewhere with this week's Ganage topic. Thank you very much, Tim. So let me tell you about the latest razzling and dazzling topics that I've chosen. program is in its third year now, and my corner has been remodeled. From now on, we will use headlines, and we'll introduce lots of information that is not covered by pictures. The first topic is that the Cartoon Grand Prize has been awarded. The Cartoon Grand Prize is famous as a reward that closely reflects readers' opinions, since no manga artist or editor participates in the selection process. The Grand Prize went to Terumai Romae. It's a unique manga that depicts Japanese and ancient Rome's public baths. Congratulations! I bet you want to read that anyway. The next headliner is that the latest Nobunaga's Ambition series is out. Tendo, the latest sequel of the popular historic simulation game series about Japan's warring states period called Nobunaga's Ambition, has hit the market. This series, which helped establish the genre of historical simulation in Japan, is known for producing many female fans fond of medieval generals. They are known as Rekijo. Why don't you join me and try to conquer the whole of Japan? Talking about Rekijo, we cannot leave this out. Sengoku Busho Matsuri. related to historical simulation games are flourishing all around Japan. Recently held was Sengoku Busho Matsuri, Warring States Live Entertainment. This event offered a variety of entertainment. Goods related to Nobunaga's ambition, Samurai Warriors and other games were offered and live performances featuring game theme songs were held. The venue really heated up as not only Rekicho, but also voice actor fans, music lovers and wrestler fans were present. If you happen to come to Japan, why not check out the latest information on this and experience the atmosphere of the Warring States period? Today's main theme. Now, as you can probably see, things have changed a little bit around here, but I'm still here, and so are Isabene. Hi! How are you doing? Very fun. We're very happy to be back here. Yeah. Season three. I know. And you see, I'm yeah. quite good at DIY. Mm -hmm. I think I did quite a good job, didn't I? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> it's cooler, I think. It's cool. But I think which is great about yeah. this season three is that people all over the world are just mailing me through Facebook, through yeah. mails mm -hmm. from Dubai, from great. London, that they saw the show and it's very interesting. So I'm really happy to be back Thank here. Thank you. That's, That's right. right. So have you been out hunting for some new topics for me? Of course, mm -hmm. we did. Today we're talking about Kaiji. Mm. Kaiji, which I know from the movie. Oh, really? Oh, but, really? but this wasn't originally a movie, right? No. You know, it's a gambling manga. Gambling manga? I thought yeah. I never looked at something like And it's that a before. new type of gambling manga, you know? Yeah. And it doesn't uh, talk about only gambling games, mm -hmm. but it's so exciting, hot, and emotional. Mm, sounds oh. very interesting. Yeah. Okay, you should know more about this. So first, watch this. <laughs> お前らが今なすべきことは勝つこと勝たなければゴミ! 
Using ultimate psychological tactics to fight over big money. A hot drama about men who engage in battles for all or nothing. We bring you a special on the hugely popular manga series, Kaiji. Gambling boasts worldwide popularity, but is illegal in Japan. However, manga that takes gambling as its theme has been published and loved since the 1970s. It gives the reader a thrill that no other manga does. The hero's complex frame of mind and the excitement over whether one is going to win or lose. Nowadays, gambling manga is changing. Manga possessing a new style different from conventional gambling is attracting attention. Kaiji is the manga that precipitated this change. The Kaiji series started in 1996. Kaiji Ito, the protagonist of the story, is a young man who has to gamble in order to return the large debt he incurred by agreeing to serve as the loan guarantor for another person. A lot of gambling games in this manga are the author's original invention. Limited Junkan, for example, is a card Junkan rock, paper, scissors game in which the number of cards is limited, so as to make strategy matter more. 74 meters above ground is a game in which the characters race over an electrified iron bar, risking death. E-Card is a card game in which players bet their eardrums. すごい心理戦とかがすごい面白くてなんか人の深いところまで知れてなんかそこ面白いなって感じました。考える心の文章の書き方がすごく人間臭いここの漫画とは一線画数あのものがあります。のめり込んでいけるというか見て楽しいな
カイジはやっぱりキャラクターがすごく個性的なんですよ、うん、でしかもその個性がヒーローとかじゃなくてダメ人間なんですね<笑>あの日本だと「太宰治」っていう小説家が昔人気で「人間失格」っていう小説を書いたんですよ、うん、それはね恥の多い人生を送ってきましたっていう書き出しから始まってすっごいみんな食いついたんですけど、うん、伊藤海事もねもうダメなところばっかり描かれるんですね、うん、それがやっぱりキャラクターの個性を出してますであともう一つはあのあれですねやっぱり人間ドラマでさっきおっしゃいましたけど、うん、あのギャンブルで勝つか負けるかっていうのは基本的に運の要素が大きいんですよ、うん、でそれが海事の場合は全部推理とそれから彼がどう立ち回るか自分の例えば焦りをどう隠すか隠しきれないかそういうところを楽しめるようになっていてこれがやっぱりカイジの人間ドラマ性を強めてますね。It's very interesting, but to find out more about the secret of his popularity, we went to interview the author, Mr. Nobuyuki Fukumoto Rowling. The hugely popular gambling manga Kaiji. Many original ideas of the author Nobuyuki Fukumoto are packed in it. Hello! Hello! Here! Hi! Nice, nice to meet you! Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Fukumoto made his debut in 1980. At that time, he drew love stories but was not able to score a big hit and fell on hard times. A turning point for him was the Mahjong manga Akagi, first published in 1992. In it, he successfully portrayed a genius gambler, Akagi, who bets his life on Mahjong. This manga, with an accurate description of a gambler's psychology, became a huge hit. So, Mr. Fukumoto, the first question is Are you a big gambler? I'm not a big gambler. 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 うん、好きですが、うん、その本当にハマってる人いるでしょそういう形ではないですね。Why did you start to write a gambling manga? 簡単に言うとギャンブル漫画しか仕事がなかったんですね。あのこういわゆるこうマイナー誌というか、えー、そういうところがマージャン漫画や、えー、パチンコ漫画や競馬漫画とかそういうものを出してまして。そこのお仕事が要するに売れない漫画家の福本としては一番取りやすい仕事でそれをこう書いているうちにまあマージャン漫画から火がついたという感じですかね。And in Gin to Kin, a manga about trickery in the world of outlaws, Fukumoto develops original gambling games. One of them is the Golden Bridge. This is a game in which the players need to guess a painting from a five meter distance. Beside guessing the picture, Fukumoto added a rule that players can buy the distance of five meters by paying a million yen per centimeter. This original idea proved to be one of the main causes of the success. So, why don't you use actually the already existing gambling but you create your own games? ああいうのは意外と複雑なんですよ実は全く知らない人も漫画を見るっていうふうに前提すると意外とオリジナルギャンブルの方が単純に物事が整理できるってのがありますねあのルールが簡単に最も単純にできるでもそれがまあ一つあとはどんなことでもギャンブルになるんだっていうかオリジナルギャンブルだと「えー、何やねこんなこと書けるの?」っていうそういう面白さっていうかなそのなんか読者のつかみというかそういう要素もありますね。Of course, in Kaiji, original games appear one after another. For example, Limited j o h n k e n is a game played with 12 cards divided into three categories rock, scissors, paper. By limiting the number of cards each player has, the author has turned a simple game that everybody knows into a psychological battle that is not swayed by fortune. How do you come up with the, those ideas of the games? ゲームそのものを考えた時に必勝法も同時に考えるんですよ考えるというかセットでくるんでそれは一つ面白いアイデアが考えてそれを打ち破るのを自分でまた考えるんですねで,でもっと何かできないかっていうかもう一枚もう一枚っていうのを考えるのが好きですねひらめきみたいなのがあってあこれこういうの面白いんじゃないって思うでしょで
それを成立するためにいろんな資格をいろいろやってそれをより効果的にしてでもそれだけだと弱くてそこをこう補強していくには結構場合によったら長い時間がかかるしあるいは長い時間かけても結果的にまとまらなかったなってこともあるかもしれないんだけどでも粘っていくとですね意外に抜け道があるんですよね。最初のひらめきはまあひらめきとしてあって、問題はそこから粘るっていうのは結構大事かもしれないなと思いますけどね。オリジナリティ not found in other gambling manga and the process leading to a victory。These are the greatest factors behind the popularity of kaiji。Impressive because he was such a normal person and very kind when we talked to him. But at the same time, you you can imagine what is going on in his head. Mm -hmm. It's so complicated, but at the same time, I mean, he catches your attention. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What can you say? Uh, he is different comparing all the author. Gamble manga を書く他の人との違いは一番一番の違いは福本さんにとってはギャンブル漫画っていうのが。描く対象であるよりは手段なんですよゲームをとにかく自分で作ってシンプルにすれば一番美味しいところ面白いところが伝わるだろうで、面白さっていうのは究極人間の知恵だとかあるいは人間ドラマ的な熱さだとかそういうそのエッセンスを取り出すのがすごくうまいですねある部分では非常にシンプルに例えば人間の欲とか弱さとかを描いてだけど他方では例えばゲームで勝つためにどう考えるかとかそれから、えー、人間がどう行ったり来たり悩むかっていう複雑さシンプルさと複雑さを両方持ってるのがヒットの秘密だと思いますね。So、also are the drawings,、uh, one of his originality. いわゆる漫画家さんの描く絵の中では決してうまい絵じゃないんですよ。もう首の角度がいつも寝違えてるとかねあの言われてるぐらいの人でただそのもう首の角度とかあとおでこが途中で切れちゃってるとかそういうのは全然人間の実はその心理とか熱さには関係ないんだで僕らがその実は人を見てる時でも全部見てないじゃないですか目だけ見てたりあるいはその首の動きだけ見てたりつまりある種そのピカソが描いたような人間の本質を撮ってきてる絵なんですよねあれは。まあちょっと褒めすぎてますけど<笑><笑> So Kaiji has been a big hit and we went behind the scene and we discovered something unimaginable Watch this What is striking in Fukumoto's work is the way he depicts characters To pointy a chin, a sharp nose In order to directly convey the character's feelings he chooses unrealistic visual expressions Fukumoto drew us the character Kaiji Which part is the most difficult to write? まあでも漫画ってほらこう動きの中で人と見つめ合ったりするもんですから、うん、目とか大事じゃないですかねやっぱちゃんとそ,その人間を見てないと話してる最中のね、うん、例えば And using ink. とここ,でここでこう回さないとこっ,ちこっちにこういう線が入りにくいんですよ。In order to clearly show straight lines, Fukumoto draws while turning the sheet around. That's his unique method. Wow! It's great! It's beautiful! We had a really great experience. He makes the hero look sharper. And as for the bad guys, Fukumoto says he depicts their ugliness by bringing out the scary look in their eyes or threatening teeth. Another factor contributing to the appeal of Kaiji is the meticulous portrayal of people's psychology in extreme situations. If you lose the game, you lose your life too. In such extreme conditions, the characters have to deal with betrayal by their buddies or elaborate cons and desperately look for a way to win. That's what Fukumoto draws so superbly. Fukumoto uses a lot of onomatopoeia in order to describe emotions in an abstract setting. He describes the mind frame of people engaging in gambling in a unique way, making the reader feel the uneasy atmosphere and the psychology of the crowd. I think that the people who are in the world are in the world. They 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 are in the world. 
だからそれが結構功を奏してて例えば目玉をいらしたり顔をいらしたり僕はこう票が乗ってくるとこう歪ませるんですけどあえてそういうことをあの使うあるいは何かの表現にするつまりこの今のギャンブルでこれもうバイブシするってことは例えばまあ言うなら大きな亀裂があってそれをかけてって飛び越えなきゃいけないとか絵柄としてちょっと要するにこうエキサイティングに見せるためにそういう別の例えをまあ僕はよく使うんですがそういうふうにしてそういう感情をみんなにトスしてる。This is one of the attractions of depicting human drama through gambling. Kaiji, who has no work and leads a life of dissipation, learns about human feelings thanks to gambling and decides to rethink his ways. The manga describes how the protagonist overcomes betrayal and disappointment and matures. Kaiji is, まあ言うならなんていうのかな、あ,あの特に限定じゃんけんの。頃は初めてそういうところにまあ放り込まれるように入ってしまってそこで多分言うなら自分の今までの人生を反省したり自分の欠点というかねこんな風なところがダメなんだっていうことを気づいたりでもそこからなんとかつまり一種の成長物語になっていてそういうことをやっぱり主人公が何らかで掴んで何らかで変わっていってそれでも。例えば裏切られてももう一度だけ信じてみようみたいなこととかも含めてなんかこうそういう姿を描きたいっていうのはありましたね。What is necessary to go through life? Thoughts on that are what Fukumoto puts into Kaiji. Wow, it's fantastic. It smells very, very good. It smells ink. <laughs> and I figured out also that the lines are very straight. There's not a round、uh, shape or something. It's very sharp. Yes.、Mm. yes. And then as for the actual manga itself, I mean, he seems very interested in the psychological aspects of the characters. Is that something that is specific to him, or, or is that something that you can say about gambling manga in general? うまく絵とそれから物語を混ぜてデフォルメして描いているそれがやっぱり福本さんの特別なところかなと And how do you think,、uh, Mr. Fukumoto might proceed from now in the future with his works? 今連載している「和也編」というところで彼は、えー、東南アジアの日本にやってきた出稼ぎ労働者たちを描いてるんですねあの一昨年のリーマンショックの話もそうでしたけどやっぱり世界の資本主義がどんどんどんどんギャンブル化してってますよねで福本さんが視線を世界に向けた時にああいうその麻雀とかじゃんけんみたいな我々の身近なものからもっと世界規模のギャンブルをね描く日が来ると思うんですよそれは多分すごく面白いだからそこに行ってほしいですね。There's something really clever about in a realistic world but then just underneath it there's this sort of dark around every corner there's this some possibility of some A make crazy thing happening to anyone, you know, any of us, you know.、Mm. I think it's really clever. Yeah, but, but I really like the main character, Kaiji, because he's living a hundred percent, you know. We should all take a leaf out of his book, I think. Yeah. Yes! Anime director Suno Katabuchi. Katabuchi was born in Osaka in 1960. Since his university days, he started working as a scriptwriter and assistant producer. He participated in many projects by Studio Ghibli, such as Kiki's Delivery Service. His latest work, My My Miracle, has won appraisal from around the world.変なお話こしらえたりしながら歩いてたんですね。家から学校まで1キロ半ぐらいだったんですけど、その往復がだいたいなんかそんなことでなんかお話作って行き帰りしてました。あ、お友達とは遊んだりっていうのは。あの、う
大阪の方でですね小さい駅の駅前で映画館を経営してた時期がありましてで一番自分のその人生の一番自分自身が持ってる一番古い記憶っていうのが「わんぱく王子のおろち退治」っていうアニメーションの映画をそこの祖父の映画館で見たっていう記憶なんですけどそれがあの。映画っていうのは公開年度とか後で調べると分かるもんで調べてみると2歳7ヶ月で見てたわけなんですねでそれあの途中から入ってこの辺から見たっていうのはなんかものすごいはっきり覚えてるんですそれがあの一番古い自分自身の一番古い記憶で高校ぐらいになってくるとあの8ミリカメラとかで映画撮ったりとかいろんなことしてたんですけど3年生ぐらいになってねえー、と本当に受験どう,しどうしようと思ってた時にそのちょうどその宮崎駿さんが初めて NHK でテレビアニメをあの作られてそれ「あの未来少年コナン」っていうのなんですけどあこれはすごく自分が小さい頃に見てたものとそっくりだとであこういう感覚って自分の中にあるなということをなんかそれであの思い出させられたっていうとこがあって。で,で要するにそこからは今,今に至るまでずっと一本道なんですね<笑>カタブチ started his career as a script writer and assistant producer and in 2000 he released Princess Arete as his first movie since then he's worked on numerous anime addressing the theme of children's hearts last year he released My My Miracle he received the spectators award at the French film festival Cine Junior which selects movies for children. He was also given the Spectators Award for the Best Animation for Adults at the Brussels Anime Festival. His work is highly appreciated by all nations and generations. そもそもそのマイマイシンコと宣伝の魔法っていうのはその子供心って言いますかね自分子供だった頃にこ,うこんなことやりたかったとかこんなこと味わったとかっていうそういうなんかワクワクする感じ。あったかい感じみたいなものがなんかあの積極的になんか表現していきたいなと思ってたわけなんですねだから多分ずっと一緒だと思うんですね入ってすぐの頃にこうやりたかったことがいまだになんか作ってるというか「マイマイシンコとセンの魔法」なんていうのは多分そういうところにまだあるんじゃないかなっていう気がするんですけどもうこれはすごく運命的な感じがしまして今までやってきた自分がこう,こういうものを作りたいと思ってきたものがなんかここにあるなっていう気がしましたほらかわい The expectations for Katabuchi's next anime are growing <laughs> Well why don't we play cards after this? Sounds good, looks like Ben is ready for some strip poker Feel free to join us <laughs> Bye bye Bye, bye.